Hello everyone, welcome to my video presentation. I will introduce a smartphone application prototype that I designed for University Makerspace users. To start with, let's look at what users say. From the user research for assignment 3, most of the users have very limited knowledge about using tools and machines. Some of them complain that the induction sessions are really brief and hard to remember all of those information. Even though the staff are friendly to offer help, but you can't ensure they are available when you need them. To get deeper insights from users' perspective, let's take a look at this empathy map. It's easier to notice that the word tool has been used frequently. This can be included that users have limited knowledge about using even hand tools. By looking at the persona that I created, it's much easier to see the user's requirement. As the problem stated, the user is lack of experience and unfamiliar with professional tools and materials. Learning is becoming extremely harder, especially for shy people who dare not ask for help. What users need is the efficient instructions. Therefore, the solution I proposed is a smartphone application for learning mechanical equipment and record project outcomes. The intended users will be engineering students who have limited knowledge. The goal is to instruct people with the proper way of using mechanical equipment to get to the desired outcome. To be more specific, a quick scenario walkthrough. James is a first year engineering student. He is introduced to use UQ Innovate Makerspace to build a robot as a cost requirement. However, he is very unfamiliar of using those professional tools and machines. His classmate introduced the engineer application to him, which is really helpful. He can pick up any tools in the makerspace and scan the QR code to get instructions. Or he can search within the application by setting several filters to get guides for the right tools or machine. He can also record his own projects to refer back anytime. This application helps James improve his skills quickly and efficiently. The paper prototype has four features. Learned page allow users to quickly review what tools users have learned. Learning page shows learning status with progress bar. Users can go to course page to search tools with several filters. Users can learn by watching video or reading instructions. Also has options to add courses to learn or learning page. They can even scan the QR code on any tool to quickly learn how to use it. According to user's feedback, a user changes have been made. Combine learned and learning pages because users get confused between these distinctions. Add project page that allows users to edit and review. Add a searching bar in learned page and view it by categories. Here is improved high fidelity prototype. Users can view their history projects or click add to generate new project. Each project includes information, needed components and tools that can be edited by users. Learn page shows what have learned listed based on tool categories. There also has a searching bar on the top. They can go to search facilities page to look for tool with several filters. Also, they can scan any physical tool to get the information. The equipment page will be like this, show the picture, instruction, caution, and video demonstration. In order to get most of user testing, I planned several tasks for users to test the usability and functionality. Based on the observation, users can complete most of the tasks smoothly. However, a user took several mistaken steps for the task 3. This might be because of poor layout. Overall, users are satisfied with the application design and functions. The future work include improve user interface layout, add reminder function, and think about how to make the scan function into reality.